friends welcome back so now i want to give us some clarity on representing packages so students are getting some doubts when to use uh, which package and how to represent that package what is the case sensitive uh, like uh, small letter we need to use or capital letter we need to so a little doubts will be there so this video is going to clarify your doubts while writing the program so java rules in representing a packages so first one i want to clarify packages and sub packages how to differentiate the packages and sub packages how the user knows this is a package and this is a sub package how the user knows let me clarify you so all small letters all small letters okay and sub packages sub packages or separated with dot symbol with dot symbol remember this okay let me explain you with an example how to differentiate the packages and sub package so packages and the sub packages all should be the small letter one thing all or should be the small letter okay and sub packages ought to be separated with a dot so java dot lang okay java all small letters util java dot awt dot event okay so java dot net java x dot swing dot text so these are the sub packages awt dot mali this is sub package this is sub package this is sub package sub package package java packages in that the sub packages will be present so every all letters should be the small letters and those are the separated with the dot symbol okay so that is the first one and the second one how to differentiate the class and interface so how do you know in the program what uh, which word is a class and which word is a interface okay so now let's see about it each word each word first letter the first letter is capital each word the first letter is a capital and no space between the words and no space between words this is very important so how you are going to identify the class or interface every word first letter is a capital letter suppose my name is a bhanu so here my name starts with the capital letter so that is a class so first letter is a capital letter and no space between the words suppose bhanu is there priya i don't want to give the space here if you give the space it consider as a two words and it will be error so don't give the space each word first letter is a capital and no space between the words okay no space between the words so word first letter is the capital bhanu is one word and priya is another word it is not the same bhanu is one word priya is another word so every word first letter is a capital letter so don't give the space every word first letter is a capital word okay and don't give the space so that is the identification of the class and interface so this is a class name okay or it, it may be the interface name let me write you the examples show you the examples here so the examples for to identify the class and interface is uh okay so here if you take the java java is a package language is a sub package and system it's a class name system s is a capital letter okay so java is a package util is a sub package and string string buffer both are the single uh, you no space between the two words okay s is a capital letter and b is a capital letter string buffer okay so this is a class or interface or if you want to call the file input stream so it may be the class or an interface so there is no all letter the first letter of a word is a capital letter there should be no space in between the words so this is how the rules that you need to be applied to representing the packages okay now let's take how to differentiate the variable and method now there is a question here third one 
how to differentiate uh, means how to represent the variables and method not the two differentiation how you are going to identify the variable and the method so in the class and interface the first letter is a capital letter the word in the first letter is a capital letter don't get confused students okay so don't get confused so class means the first letter is a capital like just now i take array index array no space index okay array index no space first letter is a capital so now class and variable second word onwards second word onwards first letter first letter is capital okay and no space between the words so just like a class and interface the variable uh, there is no space between the words but instead of first letter here the second letter onwards second word onwards the first letter so let me take example main there is no second word okay there is no second word only one word is there so just simply write main compare to c o m p a r e compare capital letter t o because the second word first letter so this represents the method method means bracket should be there okay suppose if the variable means employee number n is a capital so this is a variable this you call it as a method if brackets are there this is a method and this is a variable there is no brackets so the first uh, first letter of the second word should be the capital letter so this is a difference between the class and variables okay in the class see here the first letter of every word is a capital letter okay and in the variables the second word first letter is a capital don't get confused while you are working on the programs then you will get habituated and you can clearly understood what is the difference between the variable and the class which is a class and which is a variable that you can easily identify okay so this is a variable name and this is a class name so only the second uh, word first letter so remain uh, first is leave it it should be the small letter and whatever the words that are coming next those are the first word should be the capital letter okay so simply name name only one word okay so this is also a variable to differentiate let me write this point to differentiate class interface variables and method suppose if you want to differentiate the class interface variables and methods the capital and small letters has to be included that's why they are included the capital and small letter concept otherwise we can't understand what which is the class and which is a variable and which is the interface like that okay included so for writing programs we use any editors remember students for uh, i want i'm just i want to be clarify you again if you want to write the programs use any editors ide so ide consisting of a maximum packages will be generated by ide so for a beginners don't use the ides because all uh, inbuilt program uh, syntaxes will be appeared okay so maximum packages generated here maximum packages generated so you are not supposed to write anything automatically the packages are displayed and you are just clicking enter that's it so better don't use the ids use uh, editors only editors so that you can get habituated of writing your own packages means you can uh, uh, it will writing the program becomes habituated instead of simply uh, using already built functions right so use the editors like notepad okay text notepad plus plus okay edit text so these are all the editors you can use the uh, those editors for writing the programs so i hope you will get a clarity on the java rules that representing the packages thank you